Yo, what's good out there everyone? It's Roll Easy here, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna be going over a brand new method to hit the gift cards to friends glitch that is a different than before, but much more Xbox friendly. PlayStation can try it, but there's a part where PlayStation will struggle, or at least I struggled, all right? Let's get into it right after this message. If you're brand new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of my latest videos. If you're also interested in GTA 5 online modded accounts, go ahead and go to my latest upload and click on this link in the description. This will lead you to the website Digizani. This is the most trusted site to purchase cash and rank services on all platforms for GTA 5 online at reasonable prices. Don't forget once you're done shopping, add the discount code EEZY to save some money at the end of your checkout. All right, so now we're getting straight into this video. What you're gonna need for this glitch is a bunker, throw yourself in an invite only session, you need an MOC with the personal vehicle storage and an RH8 stored inside, all right? And you just need a friend to help you out. Now, that's literally all you need. Obviously, the friend needs a car that they're gonna be giving you. If you use this as a money glitch, remember you both must have the same custom plate if you're giving each other retros back and forth. So keep that in mind. Now, shout out to the founders, uh, Lost Glitches, Vladdy Rad, uh, everybody who was a part of this, I think Bruntango as well. So it's a really cool method and it's a lot easier to hit on Xbox. I've hit it twice on Xbox in a row and the other glitch, you know, the other method was just way more difficult and inconsistent on Xbox. But uh, yeah, so this is definitely for you guys mostly. PlayStation, you might have a problem when we're doing the right D-pad pause. At least that's where I had my issues. But like I said, give it a shot. It's a really cool and pretty simple glitch to do. All right, so... Getting into it now, what we're going to need is this RH8 that we have parked in our MOC. So we're in an invite only session. I got my RH8 from the MOC and I have my friend right here. So I'm going to pick up my friend and we're going to go ahead and drive into my bunker. Uh, you don't need the same bunker, but it's definitely a lot more, you know, a lot more of a convenience for sure because there's parts where we're going in and out of bunkers and stuff and if you can simply walk out of your friend's bunker turn around and walk back into yours that's mad convenient so i definitely recommend whoever you're glitching with you know if you all have farmhouse farmhouse is the most you know used bunker in the game so at least for glitchers so i definitely recommend it now once we spawn in here with our friend we need to go ahead and glitch out the car and this is so that we don't get a black screen in the next step all right so this is what you need to do Go ahead and park just like you see me parking right here. Leave some space on the passenger side door, but try to get as close to the bunker doors as possible without actually driving out, you know, because you get a black screen when you get to a certain place, you know, at the door. So now what I'm going to go ahead and do is tap on Y or triangle to pull open the door and pull away. Okay, I do this to both doors. Uh, this definitely makes it more consistent. So just do that to both doors. Now, you want your friend to go ahead and stand up real close so that you got easy access to get right back into the vehicle. So that's what your friend is doing. Now, you walk over to the bunker doors, you have the option to exit bunker. You're going to hit A and Y or X and triangle on PlayStation at the same time and your guy should run towards the car like this. Okay, so you're going to see it right here. I'm going to hit A and Y at the same time to exit bunker again the vehicle. Boom. If your guy didn't run towards the vehicle, your vehicle's too far away. Pull it up closer next time. So this is what it looks like in the friend's perspective. I hit A, Y, boom. Now my friend is just tapping Y right now. Keep tapping Y or triangle to get into the car. And if you get into it on time, boom, you will spawn outside just like that with your friend, all right? So now going back into my own perspective, we've spawned outside, I have my friend in the car, okay? Now you'll notice driving the RH8 around right now that it's really, you know, there's almost like there's something pressing on the throttle, basically, you know, a cutoff. That is because the game still thinks it's inside of the bunker. So doing that glitches the car out a little bit and it glitches it out enough so that now when we do the next step, we don't end up on an infinite black loading screen, which is what used to happen, okay? So we're gonna be loading in here in the bunker momentarily. Once we do, you're gonna go straight to your MOC. All right, go straight to your MOC and this is the part where PS4 might have some trouble with. On Xbox, I can hit it perfectly. Okay, first try every time. You're gonna hit right D-pad and pause at the same exact time. So right D-pad and start, all right? And you're gonna see the lights flash and then you will be completely frozen, not able to move your camera or anything, okay? So 
I'll be hitting in here very, very shortly. You'll see right D-pad and pause. Just put both your thumbs on those buttons at the same time and hit them. And just like that, I'm completely frozen. Once you're completely frozen, have your friend just get out of the vehicle, all right? Get out of the vehicle, press pause, and go to the jobs and start up a Rockstar created mission. Titan of a job is the best one to do, okay? Just, it spawns you right in place. So they've started, my friend started up Titan of a job for me from outside the car. I'm going to go ahead and get the alert to join, however you want to do it, invite or not. I'm going to have my friend back out of Titan. Once they're back down on the ground, I'm going to go ahead and accept the first alert, and I'm going to get an unable to connect. I'm going to accept that one as well. It doesn't matter if you go up or down in the clouds. It's all good. You should be able to get out of the RHA now, and you're unfrozen, and you've successfully glitched everything out. So at this point, this is like the old glitch where we got the caddy, okay? But now we're going to use it as a gift card to friends. So we're going to connect it with the other method. But this is a lot easier to be, you know, for the beginning of the glitch. For Xbox people, trust me, this is the gift cards to friends to do for you guys. This one is perfect for Xbox users. So once I get outside over here with my friend, I'm gonna have my friend call up their the car that I want. Okay, the car that I want to get from them. Now I'm gonna show you right here on the map where we're going. For those of you that haven't seen the last method that I posted. This is the area over here in Blaine County, right by the, the main airfield there where everything spawns. We're going to be using that job marker to actually glitch out, okay? So if you saw the last video, we're going to be spamming on right D-pad and accepting an MOC invite, all right? So that's right now what we're getting prepared to do. We've already done everything to get glitched out in the bunker. Now the rest is to get sucked in with the car, okay? So this is the car my friend is giving me. I'm going to hop into it and I'm going to drive to that location. If you notice, my friend is going to run right back into their own bunker. Okay. They're going to run into their own bunker, go into their MOC and sit there and wait to send me an invite. All right. So while I'm driving over to that spot, that's what we're doing. Okay. Just so you guys know. So I'm going to go ahead and fast forward all this driving right here. So you guys aren't bored out of your minds. Uh, this car has super low suspension, terrible handling, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so now I'm at this spot. I'm just going to push these cars out of the way so they don't interfere with the glitch. Not sure if they would, but yeah, so you notice you have a right D pad option. So right now what I'm telling my friend is I'm at the spot, go ahead and send me an MOC invite. Okay. So I'm going to get one here on my phone and, uh, then yeah, I'm just going to open up my phone right now, hover over, you know, getting ready to completely accept it. And right when I accept it, I'm spamming right D pad. So the first time you do it, you should just simply get a black screen. You won't get kicked out of the car. You're going to spawn into the job lobby screen like this. Go ahead and press B or circle and confirm the alert to fully back out of the job. So now you're going to be spawning real close to where we just started that job, you know, right at the job marker. So right when you spawn in, you're going to go ahead and get back in the car. We need to do that same step or those same steps again. Okay. So you have to do this twice at least. So. Now that we're back in here, I'm going to tell my friend, go ahead, send me another MOC invite. Just got one right here on my phone. I'm going to open it up and hover over fully accepting it. And immediately after accepting the MOC invite, I'm spamming right D-pad. This time you should get kicked out of the car and we're going to, you know, same deal, load up into the job and then quickly, well, I wouldn't, you don't have to rush it. Just back out normally as you would. Just don't stay, just don't linger in the job. Now, once we spawn back down, this is when you want to get into your car as quickly as possible because it usually happens on the second try. So I'm going to get back in and I'm just going to sit here and wait. Okay. And if you've done everything successfully, you should hit a black screen just like this one coming up. And then you're going to be spawning in your MOC with your friend's car. And I even put in the top right what your friend should see. Okay, so that's my friend. Boom. My friend has two cars in their garage, but I'm in my own, you know, MOC right here. And I have the car that they gave me. Okay, so I just wanted to show you a little perspective of the friend. Don't freak out. Your friend will probably see a car spawn into their own, you know, MOC. So as for this, you can go ahead and drive it out and in if you really want to, but I'm pretty sure the vehicle is saved. Okay, the vehicle saved, you're good to go. There's nothing else extra you need to do. Now, if you wanted to rinse and repeat this, oh, and that part with the, you know, with the two cars spawning in there reminded me a lot of the Sultan glitch. I guarantee you that glitch isn't dead. There's probably some workarounds for it still, but nobody likes duping Sultans. But uh, anyways, yeah, so there's no more, you know, technical things you need to do to actually get the car saved. But if you would like to rinse and repeat, what you could do is just go outside, call up an RH8, you know, from a different garage. You can go ahead and drive that into the bunker, into the MOC, or call it outside. It's up to you. But just go ahead and throw an RH8 in there. And wherever the RH8 came from, this car will end up. And you can go ahead and be ready to go ahead and do it again, uh, you know, while your friend is getting set up. You guys can do this back and forth. But like I said, this is the perfect method for Xbox. 
definitely execute it. Uh, it's much more consistent and fun to do. All right. That's one of the biggest things about glitches, having fun doing them. All right. So I hope everybody enjoyed the video. That's going to be it for me. My name is Roll Easy. Please subscribe to the channel if you're brand new by hitting that big red button. Turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video and all the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. We are on the road to 50,000 subscribers. Peace out.